Eats and Beyond. My name is Ida and today I'm bringing you a classic Puerto Rican fritter. It's a rice fritter. In Spanish it's called almohabanas. Let's get started. We're going to be using one cup of rice flour. This is the rice flour that I buy. Let me... There you go. That's the rice flour that I buy. One cup of milk. I'm using 2% but you can use whole milk or even or even one percent. Here I have half a cup of crumbled cheese and the cheese that I bought is this one. It says queso blanco. But if you can't find this hard frying cheese, of course you can substitute it for mozzarella cheese. One teaspoon of baking powder, a quarter of a teaspoon of salt, one egg, and two tablespoons of butter. This is all we, me all we need to make the almohabanas and some oil for frying. Let's get started. The first step is we're going to put the milk in a small saucepan. It's at medium high heat. We're going to place the butter and we're just going to heat it until it boils. As soon as it boils we go on to the next step. Now that the milk is boiled I'm just going to mix in these two things together. It doesn't have to be perfect. And see the milk, how it got? It's nice and hot. We're just going to pour it in a bowl. Just like this. And we're going to add the rice, the baking powder, and the salt together. And we're going to mix it up until it forms like a ball. So if you notice, it's too liquidy. And this happens. Maybe too much milk, maybe. And you just go sprinkling in by one tablespoon just like this see there you go I think one more tablespoon so you keep on mixing it and adding by tablespoon until you get a nice consistency more like um, not we don't want a batter we want it to form like a ball I think one more so one more and we'll be back with the next step. So I ended up adding about three tablespoons more of rice flour and that's fine it's better to add than to you know just ruin the dish so this is what we wanted so now we're gonna add the yummy cheese and if you like to see more videos like this hit that like but button or even better subscribe to my channel so we're just going to mix everything together and let's not forget the egg. So we're just going to mix it around, making sure everything is nice and incorporated. And you should start um, preheating a frying pan with about an inch of canola oil at medium high heat. So once this is done, I'm going to scoop them out and fry them. So my oil is preheated. And all we're going to do with two spoons, I'm just going to drop in la almohabana. And we will fry them until they're nice and golden brown on both sides. Maybe three minutes on each side. So we'll be back when I get to flip them. Don't they look cute? Look. So now you flip them just like that. Ah, they're so pretty. And this is usually served like always all our fritters are served with mayo ketchup which is just half mayonnaise equal parts mayonnaise e ketchup and a little bit of garlic powder see there you go so we just flip them and we wait a couple of, see that one wasn't ready wasn't ready so we're gonna leave it like that and we'll come back when I get to eat one so here you have a my version of rice fritters or Almohabanas. Look how cute they look, all different shapes and sizes. And of course, like I said, the dipping sauce is equal parts of ketchup and mayo. So half a cup of mayo, half a cup of ketchup, a quarter cup of mayo, a quarter cup of ketchup, equal parts. And you can add um, hot sauce to it or garlic powder. You can make it your own. <clears throat> so let's cut into one so you can see. Oh, look at the cheese. See? 
how beautiful it looks. So if you like this video, you guys know what to do. Give it a thumbs up. And after this, there's going to be a little box that says click to subscribe. Click on that if you haven't subscribed. Buen provecho. Can't wait. Oh, and thank you, hubby. He made the dipping sauce. I've been doing that a lot lately. It's so good. <laughs> Try it.